hello everyone i hope you all are doing good so at today's video i am going to quickly explain about the entrance test of for the dsd i just wake up a few hours ago and i saw the boom of the messages from the student who are applied for the winter semester that they have got the invitation for the entrance test so i cannot personally reply to everyone in the coming hours of the day so i decide to publish the video so that you can get the answer and just answer me if you have any query remains so that because i know in the time is crucial you have very less time to prepare for the test so i am just explaining a quick questions so the how was the format of the paper what subjects we are going to be asked in the paper so these are the subjects there are the seven section will be in the paper the control engineering physics maths electrical engineering chemistry informatics and system theory i guess this information you will also get in the email and there will be a sample paper uh, link in the email also so do do check the sample paper the sample paper is very important for you from that you will get the knowledge of the level of the paper the paper will be at the same level of that sample paper so in the control engineering and the system theory these two sections are Uh, cover under the automatic control which you have uh, studied in your bachelor's in the eighth semester I guess eighth seventh or sixth semester varies from university to university. So the basics of the uh, automatic controls you have to uh, you have to prepare for these two sections. After that physics physics is a very simple. It will come from your twelfth the knowledge of your twelfth which you prepared for the J E. So. Uh, that that part will become for the physics. Most of the questions are from the projectile, rectilinear motion, and simple harmonic motions. So that are quite simple. Just learn the basic formulas for the projectile, for the time of flight, and the center of mass also. Yeah. So do prepare for this for the physics in the math. Math is from your math one, math two, and math three of your engineering. The differentiation, integration, partial differentiation, and series Laplace. Uh, you will get around uh, two questions from the differentiation, two from the integration, and some from the par yeah partial differentiation will be clubbed with the control engineering questions because if you have it studied, then you will found that in control engineering there are the functions which uh, should be solved by by the partial differentiation. So partial differentiation will be clubbed with the control engineering and the system theory question. Then we come to the chemistry. Chemistry part is the very small and simple. One or two question you will found about the material, like which material will react or such that. In my paper there was a question of that what material should be used for the antennas. So for that you should prepare so that it will not get oxidized or, or uh, its uh, range will not get reduced. Something like that. The question was there from the chemistry. And I guess only two question was there. One one from this and the another one from the periodic table. Then after that the electrical engineering. Electrical in electrical engineering you will get the two or three questions from the circuit theory. Only the circuit theory will be there that you have to find the voltage or the current. But the circuit is not so simple as in the twelfth. They are a bit of higher level. The capacitor and everything will be clubbed in. So but these are basics as per your bachelor, not from the twelfth. So the electrical engineering will be the basic from your circuit theory, and in the informatics, uh, for for informatics I don't remember too much, but there are the question for solving the binary numbers and the memory cells. So this is the pretty much about the paper. Now the paper is easy or tough. The easy or tough is a relative term. We can uh, I can't say that the paper will be easy for you or not because it depends how much you remember about your. Bachelor's, bachelor's knowledge. If you are doing job from the three four years, then it may be quite difficult for you. But nothing is impossible. You should attempt the paper. I will suggest you don't quit. Just attempt the paper and attempt every question. There is no negative marking. You should attempt every question and just try. And yes, one more thing. You have to give the exam through the procurator you. And remember, in the procurator you, your camera will be on. You will be under the surveillance. You can't take help from the any other human inside uh, inside of you. You can't use the books. It will be solely depend on you, and your rough papers will also going to be checked. So, be responsible. Don't try to cheat. Just attempt the paper, and rest. Give it to your court. So, I wish you all the best. Do your best. See you in DIT.